Thursday the 17th of May. My name is Steve Buswell and you're watching Axery's broadcast. Let's start with a technical outlook for the euro dollar. Price will probably rebound soon from resistance R1 and continue in a sideways move. Later we can expect a climb below daily pivot and price could reach support S1 and still be in consolidation. Break above and below this levels will be indicating further direction. Overview of Axery's chosen indicators show a bullish trend. Secondly, we have the dollar yen. After price fell below daily pivot, we can expect target S1 support. If price doesn't rebound again and fall below last low price, it could break below support and focus on S2 before rebounding. A vast majority of our indicators expect a bearish trend. Following that, we have the outlook of the sterling dollar. If price doesn't rebound from daily pivot and doesn't focus on S1 support, we could expect rise above daily pivot in this case, target will be a resistance R1, and if price will have enough momentum, next objective could be at R2. According to the summary of our chosen indicators, we expect a bullish trend. Finishing up our outlook is the dollar franc. Price will soon reach support S1 and could possibly rebound and focus on daily pivot. But in the case of further fall, we can expect next objective at S2 support, where price will rebound and focus on retesting daily pivot. Indicators show a bearish trend for the dollar franc. We'll start with weekly numbers about unemployment claims in the United States, which will be published at 1.30 p.m. GMT. It's expected rise from 367,000 to 368,000 in jobless claims, and analysis are expecting high impact on the dollar. Swiss and German bank holiday will concern figures about fully fed manufacturing index. The survey will be published at 3 p.m. GMT, and in previous report, index rose 8.5 points, and analysis expecting now rise 10.5 points. Readings above zero indicates improving conditions and fall below zero suggesting worsening conditions. Moreover, it will have a high impact on the dollar. Finally, we bring you the summary of our best traders on their strategies on Actuary, which are available for you. PM Invest Capital remains in first place with Mirror Trader Platform, but in second place is now Glimpsy Strategy with 857.9 pips, and Teo fell in third position with 123 pips. Low risk invest strategy remained unchanged, but V9 Direct fell 22% and Forex Scam declined 9.5%. Next trade leaders, LW Trading recorded the biggest gain today when it rose 76%. Johnny Jang also rose and added 4% holding to second place, and in third place, Whitestone Asset rose 7%. And on this date in 1792, the New York Stock Exchange was formed. Thanks for tuning in to Axe broadcast. Have a great day trading, and we'll see you tomorrow.